Hi friends, today we are going to talk about uh, how we can uh, default a file location when we are saving from SAP. This is very common and everyone in a, who is running, probably running reports and all those things, always export data into Excel. Okay, so it may happen. So what you do is you go to, I'm just giving an example of what I'm going to show. So I go to FBL 1N, okay, and I have this data. And I'll click all items, okay, and I just execute. And now I need to download it. How to download the data? You go to list, save, and local file. And here we probably select what you want, text with tabs, okay, and you press the green arrow, right? Once you press the green arrow, this directory is always defaulted to this. And what you do is you go here, it's one click, okay. Then what you do, you go to one, then you select desktop, and then you select, suppose, uh, SAP test, okay. So I want SAP test. So that's one, two, th three clicks, okay, and then you mentioned it. So a lot of clicks looking around and all those things how i can default that this will be the name okay so let's let's default it okay you might be saying how is it possible we need to know that okay so i'll show you how we can default it, okay so what i'm going to do is i'll close this now okay and uh, i'll close this okay and now what i'm going to do i'll go to this folder this is the folder and I'll just select this and I'll select copy address as text okay and now what I'm going to do is I'll go to SU3 SAM umbrella 3 transaction okay and here I'll go to parameters okay and I will just select I think it was GR8 is it GR8 yeah so GR8, file transfer download path, okay? And here, I'll just put this, okay? And I'll save it. Next time, I'm here. I go to system, I go to list, I go to save, and I go to local file. And I'll go to text with tabs. What magic it did? It brought me to the folder, which I have. So I have saved at least four or five clicks. And I didn't have to traverse around and all those things. So that's the way we can work smart. So this was how we download. There's always a case where we have to upload also. Okay. So now let's talk about how to upload. Okay. So let me go and show you what I'm talking about. So here I want to, I go to favorites and I want to upload from PC. So if I want to upload from PC, by default it shows SAP GUI, which I don't want. Okay. I want to have an upload folder where you want to upload data and all those things you do. Uh, so uh, this we will up, uh, default that path of upload. So what I'm going to do, same thing I'm going to do here. I'm going again here to slash n su3. Okay. And then what I'm going to do is I'll click here and uh, I'll go here and I select GR I think it's GR star I'll just do a search I don't remember the name actually it's I think GR 9 okay and I'll just select this okay and I'll click green arrow now I will just put the same thing and I'll save it. Next time I go to favorites and I want to say upload from PC. See where it comes. So we did two things download and upload and we put the default uh, path and that will save you some time and some clicking. Okay. So that's it. Stay tuned to my SAP channel and happy SAP learning and have a great day.